good morning everyone good afternoon if you are watching in the afternoon so i don't know what my neighbors are doing but i'm by the window <laughs> peeping <laughs> looking but yeah so let's talk so i am actually loving the idea you all told me so yesterday i put out a video and i was asking you guys to help me out help me out i don't know what to do and you just said just share life tips and stuff so that is what i'm going to do i'm going to share life tips and i hope this helps somebody um it's gonna be a little bit about how we do stuff right me and my family i don't know who's cutting their grass anyway so I want you guys to know something and I don't know whenever I'm talking well when I'm talking right now I'm talking as per someone living in the US but you could also apply it to wherever you're living right um, one thing that we do periodically is look at our bills and contact you know when I say look at our bills it's not like we have bills like normal bills um, and the bills I'm talking about is like electricity bills water bills cable internet bills tv bills like um streaming or whatever bills and see if we can negotiate the price with the um company we also see if there are any deals going on and you can you don't have to set a time to do this please don't you don't have to do it every single month you can say okay every three months i'm gonna call the company and say is there any special offers that you have going on so recently my husband did this and he is like he is the you know when somebody is um, searching for something scavenger aunt yeah so he is the scavenger hunter for deals when it comes to saving money on utensils saving money on this saving money on that oh yeah my neighbor is cutting the grass so I I was like, I have to tell you guys about this. I think this is such a life hack or life, um, something that you can do to save money. Who doesn't like to save money, right? I love to save money and I love to cut costs wherever I can because that money can really go towards the kids' education. College is expensive. When I say expensive, um, unless your child has a full ride, I don't care. If your child is in state, it's cheaper, meaning that they're going to school within the state that you're in. But if your child is going to school outside of state, it is a whooping a lot of money. Our daughter is going to school in the state. And we told, well, you know what? Let me talk about that in another thing. So regarding saving money on your utensil, on your utilities or stuff, you call them up you ask them you tell them for example let's say your electricity right what you do is that you'll call your electricity people and you say are there any specials going on right now now they might say oh there's really nothing and you can say oh i've been a long time client uh, client customer of yours do you all have something something that is um that i can use that i can uh, let me see if i move away do you have something something that is more affordable or lesser in price they might say oh we have this we have that you can also ask them that can you check my usage sometimes what they'll do and in our case what they did was that they said the usage that we were using we weren't using as much for the amount we were paying so that gave us a negotiating power to negotiate and ask for a lower cut or cut so some um, electric companies do that so the electric company that we use is um called ambit now um this electric company we just recently found out that in the summer months you pay half the amount of what you normally will pay in terms of electricity so i was like well i like i like 50 percent off so it was so nice to get that deal so now we have a deal whereby in the summer months we only pay half the amount and you all can do it with whatever electric company you use cable company so let's talk about saving money on your cable uh of course number one look 
at your cable look at what you're using for electric uh, for your tv if you have paying your tv separate your internet separate your phone separate look at combining everything look at doing a bundle deal now a bundle deal will save you more money than individual deals so that was the first thing we did we bundled up all our expenses when it comes to cable internet and phone that reduced the amount little by little okay much it reduced the amount now the next thing that we did was we looked our um tv and then we said do we even use all these cable services because most of the time we're streaming right we're doing to be honest with you my family we watch youtube next netflix amazon prime video and hulu those are all the, that is all we use i can even remove hulu from it that is all we use so we don't use normal tv if, if we want to hear about the news we can get it online and stuff so we decided i think we did this two years ago we decided to stop with the tv cable bills and stuff and that dropped the price drastically it really 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 dropped the price so that's something you can look in terms of cable internet and um phone now the next one is your water bill yeah your water bill what you want to do to save money in your water bill is you want to look around your house you want to make sure that no faucets are leaking true you all don't do that go around your house make sure that there's no leaking faucets look at all because our house right now we have three external faucets one in the backyard two on the sides so make sure that you are it's tight it's not leaking because what happens is that a little drop amounts to a lot you will be surprised how much that is next you look at in terms of your water do you realize that and this i heard somewhere now if this is wrong please please correct me i heard that using dishwasher is less expensive less water than hand washing so what we've been doing is we've been mostly using dishwasher and kind of running dishwasher so we kind of pile up the place and then rush the dishwasher in the evening and most of the time this is during the weekend because during the day i'm the only you know it's just me and i rarely use a lot of plates and stuff so i can quickly just hand wash it but when we're in the weekend is when we use a ton of water so that actually helps cut costs now this other one might be i don't know it's up to you but in terms of flushing the toilet yes you flush the toilet after you go right but then this is a little at night because the you know if your toilet makes a lot of noise at night at night you flush in the morning right so you pee during the night and then you flush it at night in the morning instead of flushing 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 now if you do number two please 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 flush <laughs> please 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 flush okay so in terms of water another thing that we do what else we do in terms of water i think that is it yeah that is pretty much it in terms of water i'm pretty laid back now in terms of um ac and um keeping the house cool and in the warmer weather keeping the house um warm in the cooler weather keeping the house warm one thing that we do is that we got a smart listen we got a smart thermo, uh, thermostat a smart thermostat for us really cut down the price really really helped us out so getting a smart thermostat when we're not at home let's say we're traveling we can set a thermostat to shut down use my phone and we can tell it to start up again we can set it to a particular temperature so the temperature we keep our thermostat in is 79 degrees and for us that works for us and then in the cooler weather in the war um when it's cooler i think we set it as uh gosh i forgot i think like 72 71 yeah around that and for us that works fine the next thing you want to do is you want to look at your ac unit check your um uh, fluids i think it's like ferrules or i know i'm not pronouncing it well but make sure you maintain it if you maintain your ac well you don't 
run it too heavy it doesn't mess up it doesn't take a knot of energy and utilize um, utility a lot so those are the tips i have for you today how to save money on your utilities what has really helped us out if you enjoyed this kind of video let me know share it comment 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 and please don't forget to subscribe i'll talk to you later take care bye